هذه الزيارة زارت إحدى العوائل الفلسطينية هناك. And I knocked on the door, and the mother opened the door like this. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Fadal. She was so full of light. She was full of light. Her eyes were shining. Her skin was shining. And she opened the door as if I was going into the Taj Mahal. As if she lived in the most beautiful place in the world. And when I went into her home, what was in her home, Sheikh? Fish. Nothing. Nothing. A room like this, but empty. Only walls, floor, ceiling. And one rug, and the iftar for ten people was on the rug. And what was the iftar? One plastic plate of um, hummus, one plastic plate of uh, hubs, one plastic plate salad. So when I sat down, I said, no, 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 no. Wallahi, I tried not to eat. Sheikh, I tried not to eat that woman's food, but she kept giving me food. She said, you are our guest. And she gave me so much and she wouldn't take no and I ate and I felt angry. I felt angry at Islam. I felt angry at a book that would tell hungry people to be hungry for 30 days. I was angry at the Quran for telling this poor woman not to drink water when always her water is dirty. So I said to the mother, why do you fast in Ramadan? Why? What is the point? And she said to me, I fast in Ramadan to remember the poor. This mother who had nothing in dunya, nothing, will never have perhaps anything in life. She was humbling her heart for other people who had less. What is this? This, this woman who knew only tribulations was emptying her stomach to thank God. For an empty stomach, what is this? And I thought at that moment, Sheikh, if this is Islam, I want to be Muslim. Oh